So, um, does Monster Jam need crush cards? This video is gonna be about if Monster Jam, like, needs crush cards to stay relevant and, you know, be good. Because lots of fans, like, say, um, like, how they want crush cards back to be good for Monster Jam. Or they just really want it back. But for, um, so today's video, we're gonna talk about crush cards. And if we, if Monster, Monster Jam really still needs them. But first, let's go through its history. So, back in 1982, Bob Chandler, the driver of Bigfoot, was the first one to crush ca crush cars for a, um, a stunt. But later on in its history, it will start to be used as a, as like a, uh, a ramp. So, um, the trucks can, you know, do their stunts and do what they usually do in race. And this will be a really big thing for um, the monster truck industry because crush cars were, will continue to be as the, main obstacle course for um for monster trucks as a whole monster jam you know you know etc all monster truck promotions started using crush cars as a obstacle but for monster jam monster jam <clears throat> on february 15 2019 this will be the end for crush cars and monster jam unfortunately this came a big shock to the fans like a massive shock lots of fans were really 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 dis devastated because crush cars, everybody grew up with crush cars. They were really memorable. Lots of people had, like, memories of them always being crushed. Like, monster trucks are literally known for being crushed by crush cars. And the, the main monster truck promotion getting rid of them is a really big deal, honestly. But in 2022, after Monster Jam returned to their full season after the pandemic, we started seeing crush cars be used, but only in dirt, but... They still were somewhat being crushed if the trucks were on them, but they are rarely being crushed. Like, I'm showing pictures on screen on them being in dirt, but in the Superstar Challenge of 2023, they actually returned up a full bus and crush her standalone crush cars, which was really big for the fans. Also, they made a little appearance um for the, um, the Monster Jam World Finals in, L in LA, and um they were both used for a Two stunts, the Sparkle Smash stunt and the Fortnite stunt, which some fans were kind of mixed about those stunts, about them being kind of lame. I, I think they're just okay, honestly, but still. So that was its history, but now we're back to our main question. Does Monster Jam need crush cars? So, um, so this is a weird but interesting question. Lots of fans, I'm not going to point out names. I, I don't want to show the names because I... Don't want to ask for permission. They're probably going to say no. But still, lots of fans really want Crush Cars again. And lots of fans say Monster Jam is not good as it was without Crush Cars. But is that true? Okay, so for me personally, I do not think that's true. I love Crush Cars like a lot still, as much as everybody does. But I'm going to say here, Crush Cars are overrated. Monster Jam can move on without Crush Cars. I said it. We are starting to see newer stints like front flips. Moonwalks, bicycles, we're seeing a new competition like the two wheel skills. This crush car is the only purpose it really has now is for freestyle, but that's not. That's, freestyle has changed so much, especially how there's backflips, you know, like there's like so much now, but but crush cars, crush cars had memorable moments when it came to freestyle, but there wasn't fully a lot. When it came to memorable moments in Monster Jam, it came to the trucks itself doing a crazy stunt without crush cars being needed for that stunt but honestly this is my opinion everybody has their own opinion i respect it but for me i feel like we monster jam does not really need crush cars it's great to see crush cars being used randomly for big shows but still i don't i feel like it's better without crush cars but not really better i think crush cars have removed one thing that's like what can i say like the I don't know. They, they let up, let them, let them. I can't. I'm really sorry about that. They just um, hmm. I don't know what to say. I think this made a like the fans really disappointed about them being gone, especially how like let's just say the general fans. The general fans definitely noticed that they were not being used no more, which I probably left like left a lot of people like not going no more because you know they want to see cars getting crushed. That's what monster trucks are pretty much known for. Big stunts and cars getting crushed, but I I think Monster Jam can move on. But the thing is, I don't hate crush cars. I love crush cars. I'm always satisfied to see that. But 
vans, buses get crushed. It's it's really cool to still see it get crushed, but I think Monster Jam personally needs not needs but can move on pretty much without crush cars. Uh so yeah. I think that's all I can say for this video. We have reached the end of this video. So the reason why I pretty much want to make this because I feel like this is a, a pretty interesting idea because if like Monster Jam really needs it. And I already said my opinion, but I have not seen anybody like really done this, so I kinda want to be the you know first one to do it. Also, I even though like I'm sorry about messing up a couple of lines and stuff, really sorry about that, but I still had a fun time making this video doing the research and stuff about someone's history and if we kind of need them but yeah that's all i can really say so um thank you guys for watching remember remember um to like and subscribe and see you guys next time